If you're into hitting the links, you probably know that putting is a huge part of your golf game. It's about half of your score, so it is important. But the good news is... From a beginner, two, three-year-old, all the way to a senior, anybody can putt. Three-year-old could do it, I think I could maybe yeah. do it. <laughs> so to learn how to putt with precision, we turned to Tim Suzor, founder and CEO of Putting World in Scottsdale, Arizona. First of all, you have to get a putter that fits you. So a lot of people just go in and buy a putter off the rack, but there's a lot of variables to the putter. If you use the wrong putter, it can negatively affect your shot. So you'll start by measuring for proper length. Where are you measuring from? I'm just measuring from the ground right to your wrist joint right here. So there's sizes on them just like shoes? Yes. So you're actually going to be probably in about a 31 inch putter. There's a lot of other putter variables like the lie angle, grip, loft, weight, balance, and shaft to take into account. So you would recommend going in and getting a professional fitting? Absolutely. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And not just going by pretty color? You can pick a color after we get a fit. <laughs> Next, let's talk putter grip. And I want you just to put your fingertips about the top, top of your knees. And then I want you to get where you feel stable. Don't let me push you. Okay, that's better. That's good. Stop now, pushing me, Tim. <laughs> now clap your hands together. Then put your putter in the palm of your hands, keeping your hands close together. And then just tilt your eyes down. I'm like scared to move. <laughs> <laughs> tilt down. There you go. All righty. Now, does that feel comfortable? No. He says, breathe and try to loosen up. Golf is fun. <laughs> now Tim's taking us through stance and ball position. Your Rip. stance is pretty good. It's shoulder width apart is usually what we like. And for positioning. The leading edge of the putter would go right underneath your sternum. And that's because that's where it's gonna reach its maximum speed. And the ball goes right in the middle of the putter face. If you don't. The ball's not gonna travel that far. Let's put the ball in the center of the face and then go ahead, up, oh, center of the face. Okay. It's still not the center. <laughs> It takes practice, okay? Finally, speed and aim. So speed is really important. And it takes? What we call it kinesthetic awareness. Basically, you have to trust yourself and your senses. Golf is played on a very subconscious level. You can't consciously think about all these all right. things. Well, I'm just gonna forget everything you said then. And <laughs> As for aim? You aim from back here. When you walk into it is where we do the aim. He says, keep your eyes on the hole as you walk in. I can see the ball in my peripheral vision. So what the brain will do, it'll connect them. So when you set your stance, he says your brain will remember where the hole is and you just go for it. I know there's a lot to remember, so he says practice, but at the end of the day, just have fun. <laughs> Club drop. Good job. Thank you. Now we are one step closer to putting like a pro.